on run to the national championship game is good for more than just the university. It really has an economic impact on the whole state, and that's going to be felt long after the game is over. Tim Becker here to explain right now. Tim. Yeah, I spoke with both an economic and a sports marketing expert, and they tell me that the exposure Oregon gets, and I'm talking about the whole state, not just the university, from what's been happening with the football team is priceless. It goes beyond what's actually bought and sold, they tell me. It's the intangibles. They hauled in the Heisman Trophy. It's part of this whole validation process that I think has led us from where we began 20 years ago to where we are today. They embarrassed unbeaten Florida State in the Rose Bowl, and now they're a part of history. We're going to take the title in the first national playoff game. It's a string of success that's reaping rewards for an entire state. There is a, a short-term reputational bump that comes with this, uh, with a university uh, and a state that's pretty obscure uh, in most of the country. Economy expert John Taponia tells me the nationwide publicity is priceless. His Econ Northwest firm tracks things like this. Google the phrase, why is Oregon so? And the top autofill option is good. It's not necessarily because people are Googling about the state of Oregon and wondering why it's so good. People are getting on the internet and they're Googling and they're trying to figure out how the Oregon football program uh, mm -hmm. became as good as, as they did. He says reputation helps keep the state on the top of lists. For example, United Van Lines just declared Oregon the top moving destination in the country with move in versus move out statistics to prove it. It also attracts more out of state tuition and reengages alumni and their money at the university level. But raising the state's profile in the eyes of the country is what winning does best. They'll learn more uh, about the rest of what we do well here too, which is Intel and, and Nike and Columbia Sportswear. If people are, you know, basking in the reflected glory of the success of the Oregon football program, whether they're in-state being proud Oregonians or out-of-state being intrigued by what Oregon's all about, there's, uh, there's money to be made there. So a lot of intangibles. In the end, probably the most impactful thing being just attracting people, their money and their wallets to Oregon. No real values on income from this big game, but I'm sure something like that will come up after the championship game is over. Dan? All right.